The economic fallout from the coronavirus continues with small business owners among those wondering how they will make it through. In Avon, one shop owner is channeling all that uncertainty into action tonight. Lindsay Buckingham reports this three hero is now working to keep frontline workers safe. Spring typically brings a flurry of traffic to a bride's design. Wedding season full of excitement and anticipation. But this year, instead of booking appointments, owner Laura Smith is just trying to provide some comfort. They're heartbroken. I'm heartbroken for them. Brides like Jacqueline Hack, who picked up her gown curbside, hopeful that her July wedding will still go off as planned. It's kind of surreal watching friends um, who have already supposed to have had their weddings um, that be canceled or pushed back or things like that. Um, but just taking it day by day, um, faith over fear. Smith's small business hurting, but her outlook is measured. A bride's design survived the last recession, and Smith survived cancer, not once, but twice. You know, getting through that was definitely hard, uh, but it realized how important my health is. If you don't have your health, you, you don't have anything. Her focus now is not what she can't do, but what she can. I've spoken to quite a few of my friends that are nurses or doctors, and my best friend is a dental hygienist, and she's still working on emergency surgeries, and um, she's really nervous. So if there was anything I could do to help protect her, um, I want to be able to do that. Smith and her family are sewing. Those garment bags, meant to protect bridal gowns, are made from non-woven polypropylene, a material also used in surgical masks. I put my whole family to work on making these masks. We're gonna distribute them to the, the medical people in the industry. With her brides still on her mind, Smith has opened her heart to those on the front lines. It makes me feel good. It makes me feel that I can do something to help protect lives, and that's, that's what my focus is right now. What can I do to help? We don't know what tomorrow will bring, but today I can focus on, and today I can help, I can help bring safety to people. Lindsay Buckingham, 3 News. That non-woven polypropylene, the material in the garment bags is in short supply now. And Russ, my wedding dress came in one of those bags because Laura designed it. She has 36 of those dress bags on hand now, and she says each one will make about 40 masks. Uh, another example of folks doing great things. We've been lucky we've been showing a lot of these stories every night, so it's fantastic.